I would be happy to be distributing prizes, um, but the county party, like the state party, um, could use your regular donations. If you haven't yet um, signed up to become a member and paid your dues, uh, please do. If you'd like to make a regular recurring $5 a month, um, that, that, would, that makes a big difference to us, $5 a month. Um, makes a big difference over the course of the year. Uh, we are one of only, I believe, two county parties in the state that keeps an office open all year long. All the rest of the county parties, they, they come and go and just have a mailbox. We have a mailbox and an office, and that's an office where our elected officials can meet with constituents, where um, we can meet and strategize, where uh, we are always there. People know that they can come and find us. Um, we do have a good reputation around the state. Having the office is an important thing that we do. If you can toss us an extra little bit of money, we would be happy to take it. Thank you very much, all of you, for coming this evening, for supporting democratic values, for knowing that what we do here makes a difference. Um, our next meeting is uh, uh, the first Monday in August. Our speaker will be Corey Hull from the MPO. The MPO is going undergoing um, a survey that has to do with transportation. He will be soliciting our input that evening, so please come and give your input about that. At the end of August is qualifying for all those municipal offices. Um, in September, on the uh, not on Labor Day, but on the next week, we will invite all of the declared candidates to come and talk to us. They are nonpartisan races, as Deirdre mentioned. That means everybody's welcome here. Uh, so we'll get to hear from all the candidates uh, locally. And in October, our speaker will be Matt Martin, the city planner, and he will talk to us about how the city works with the county, how they work with the RDC, how DCA plays into that. Um, what the Zoning Board of Appeals and the Planning Commission do, he's, he's got a big agenda. And then, before you notice, November we'll be voting again. SPLOST will be um, on the ballot as far as we know. Uh, they have a certain day that they have to say that they're going to do it, and that comes from the county chairman. And Joyce, do you have any detail for that? Okay, August 23rd is the last day that they can sign up to say they're going to do that and... No, the ballot is written for the ballot. Okay, so you'll get to hear all about SPLOST. Um, they'll be, I think, different than new projects. Last time they voted no, and so then new projects. Do you want to talk? Come on, come, come up here, otherwise I can't hear. I know it's sort of late, but I